Hello, citizens of Radamite like Nation of uh, whatever country you decide to reside in, welcome to the frontiers. We're playing Invisible Ink. Failed yet another run. That is just sad and frustrating. What did we unlock? In fact, target to break one firewall each turn. How much does it cost? Why does it say one? Is it like. Oh, it's level one, I guess. How much does this cost? Does this cost any power at all? Huh. Can go parasite lockpick and just rely on international's ability to hack into the consoles, although power drip is just so good. I say we go with the standard lockpick. Okay. Welcome back, operator. Incognito is picking up some strange power. Our cost is the bars on the left. Oh, thank you. We don't that's know actually what it all means yet, pretty but useful. It's so I guess that's one power cost. We should prepare cost. for a major action in the coming days. This won't be easy. Yeah, I know. Okay, so what we have here? Thin. We have a Keo vault, lucrative contracts and targets, executive terminals, detention center. Opposition. That could be interesting. I'll let you choose the missions as you see fit, but be careful. A simple guarded detention center. Right Let's concentrate that. They're rebooting their regional servers, and on this could be interesting. We might get another agent right off the bat. I wonder who's that agent going to be? Is it going to be Salem? Okay. Right, time to make a profit. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. International. Send you to the left, I guess. Oh, sorry, not to the left, to the right. Go to this door. Fortunately, we cannot peek. But that's fine. It's a code, co a card coded door. And a non card coded door on the front. Move to that. Enter. Obviously, so far, so good. Yeah, I know how the power drip works. Thank you. Let's do a scan. Okay, so we've got stuff. That's a lot of stuff. Let's peek. There's a console. Hmm. It only costs us very little, very little to disable the turret, so we're going to disable it. This uh, renders the turret inactive. Good. We don't need it active. We don't want to pay for the cleanup cost and, uh, you know, attract unwanted attention. Let's peek through the door. It seems like it's just a console. Let's just break in. Yeah, we might as well get some more power from this. Back. All right. So, international. I think that's a guard. So I don't want to trigger anyone. We'll end the turn. Yeah, I think that was a guard. I think I'm right. All right, move the record. Close the door. And go forward, of course. Let's open the door. There's another corporate safe. Peek again. All right. Seems to me like we should hack whatever we can see until the firewall levels increase. Um, hmm. Are we going to be safe if we move to this thing? Let's try this. We're going to move here. We're going to loot the corporate safe. 150 uh, credits. I'm going to call them credits. Alright, enemy activity. Come on, guard. I dare you. Alright, well, he didn't spot us, so that's good. And I think he's just gonna walk away if we don't do anything else. We can move Deckard here. He can just, I don't know, whatever, peek. And turn. Because if we do anything with International, she, she's, she's gonna get spotted. Additional cameras activated. Did we miss a camera somewhere? I don't think we did. Alright, international, move you to the door. What? Oh yeah, there's a there's a lamp there. Uh, we're gonna do a risky move and open the door. 
is a console database. Let's hack that. <coughs> see what we can see. Alright, so there's like a huge area here. Let's get in. Go to this. Police dart gun. That seems very useful. Hollow circuit overloaders. Nah. Hammer. Locks five. Breaks five firewalls for five power. I say that we don't buy anything and save our money. Okay. Deckard. Now, I think you go here to the safety of this globe wall in the console and you hack the console for three power. That seems to be fairly useful. And we end our turn. Fortunately, the guard is going to patrol again. That's annoying as hell. But we can flank him and knock him out. It would be interesting if he has a pass card. Yeah, let's knock him out. Take down the guard. Steal valuables. There's just a credit. Uh, well, shit happens, I guess. Move the body for a little bit. Drop it. International. Get out of here. Close the door. Oh, I could also explore the area over there if he had a pass card. Fortunately. Unfortunately, he didn't have a pass card. Alright. You can pin the guard down for a long time, so that's not an issue. Now, Deckard, I think what we're going to do is we're going to pin the guard with International and we're going to move Deckard and open the door, peek through. Okay, there's a camera. Shit. Hack it. Hack that one too. Peek through to see the rest of the room. And we got spotted by a guard, which is great. And now this guy wants to know what the crap is going on. Alright, so I think what we do is uh, we go with International over here, we leave her on Overwatch, we hack the console from a distance, and uh, we move Deckard here, so he pins down the guard. Alright, that seems like a very nicely planned turn. I'm not saying very good, because I'm not good at the game or anything. Alright, so now we have two guards to worry about. steal stuff as a pass card. So we could definitely, in theory, move the guards a little bit and uh, see what's over there. The guards are so heavy. Jeez. Oh, really? Security is still curious about this position? Alright, we'll drag the body. I wonder if he can reach this right now. It doesn't matter that both of our melee moves are on uh, cooldown. Let's just hope that uh, nobody can see that and uh, might as well hide behind the cover. If, we, if we, we get spotted, then we can hide behind cover here. Because we simply don't have our reactions. Oh shit, he can see us. That's a captain. Who's the captain? What's the difference? Alright, hide. Damn it, they got away. Good. It's a good thing that we got away. Now what you gonna do about it? Okay. So, we're gonna get over here. Hide behind this thing, and then we're gonna move with Deckard, and uh, we're gonna do the neural disruptor melee reaction. Can we move you here without spotting? No, this location is noticed. Okay, let's wait. All right, this guy is taken out. Ay ay ay. 
that ain't no fun. Okay. Shit just got pretty darn serious. We can still do melee reaction and we can still sneak behind this guy. What? This guy's KO'd for six turns? Whoa, that's just great. I love it. Of course, at any given time, you could just, you know, turn on the turret. If it gets too serious, we turn on the turret. Fortunately, this guy's gonna wake up. This guy's gonna get taken out. Wakey, wakey. Now, we both have pass cards, so that's good. Let's steal valuables. 100 credits. It's a pretty good mission uh, money-wise, I have to admit. Um, and I guess we now split off. One guy checks out this area and uh, we let International sneak by here. Yes, we'll let her sneak by here. And then she can go and check out what's behind this coded door. Actually, I think these areas are connected, so you might as well go check out what's going on here. Yes. Can we close this door? Is this a door? Yeah, it is a door. Close it. Get over here. Open. That blackness. There's an elevator. Good. Go behind the door. Close it. Move onwards. Fairly, fairly good mission so far. I'd say. Next turn. I think somebody's down. Call me in. This guy woke up. Now they want to find out what's going on here. The captain is going to be down for like four more turns, which is amazeballs. Is there any ha anything hackable in this? What the hell is that? Why is this coded? I have no idea why this is coded. Well, anyway, close it. It's no use. We'll stand behind this door. Then we'll try to get into this area. Now, international. Can get over this door, close it, and move. Move a little bit more forward towards that closed door. Okay, so we're doing fine. Managed to evade most of the guards so far. Okay, that's that. I don't like this. Like this. Deckard has this ready though. So we open the door. The guy spots it. And we do melee reaction. While international. Get over here. Unlock the door. Open it. Because I'm pretty sure we triggered like all the guards. Okay. Hack corporate safe. Hack corporate safe. Good stuff. Loot. Amazables. Closed door. Loot the corporate safe. Where's our little elevator again? It's over there. Okay. <clears throat> now we end the turn. We wait for the guard to get over here. Additional guard patrol. I wonder where that guard patrol is. Not sure, but it might be over there. Somewhere. We stole all the valuables from this guy, apparently. We could hide behind this console. I think that's a fairly decent idea. Close. And hide behind the console. So that after that we could uh, rush forward or something. Through here. Oh, oh, we could use the cloak. But no, I'm actually going to wait for the cloak. Could be useful for a more dangerous situation. Fuck. There's another camera here as well. Alright. Cool. Sure that we can uh, hack the console from a fair distance. Yeah, like that. Actually, leaves me some AP to peek around corners and that is a corporate safe and that's a guard uh-huh well we'll think about this for a second just uh, keep the division a 
Isn't that good? We just didn't do it. Okay, so most of the guards are just like over there. Oh, okay. This guy's going, uh... This guy wants to find out what's going on over there. I think we need to use the cloak device. Or, we could also let the Internationale do the work, do the job. I think the detention block is like right here. It's like the last, the last possible room for it. Not corporate safe. It's an interesting safe, I didn't see that before. Puts you in a melee reaction. And, uh, we let Deckard peek. God, it's so annoying, man. And this guy walks around the corner and gets taken out by the International. Good job, International. Okay. Oh, what happened? Oh, what happened? I think that was the captain, in fact. Okay, let's get out of here. Close the door. And we get to the corporate save now. Save. Safe. Okay. Now what? Oh no, that's what that was this guy. Oh god. Yeah, we're gonna make a run for it. Just sneak behind the guy. Cell door. Okay, we've reached the detention block. Good shit. Okay. Now international. Go check out the con uh, the corporate safe. That was a lot of money. And corporate intelligence. That's just great safe. Selected unit cannot, cannot move there? What, is that like a dip? Are you fucking kidding me right now? The amount of cameras that spotted us is just insane. Alright, there's nothing useful here. There's no way. Okay, we'll have to get... Uh, behind this guard somehow is gonna wake up next turn. Well, that's just an insanely, insanely stupid layout. I thought that's a door into this area. Well, anyway. Cognito has detected a prisoner. Let's rescue him. Deactivate cell doors. Who are you? Prisoner. I don't know who you are, but if you get me out of here, you won't regret it. He has wealthy benefactors. It might be worth our while to help him. Okay. Let's try to get, out, get you out of here, buddy. There's nothing else of nothing of value here. I actually discovered all the all the entirety of the floor. That's interesting. Now international. Let's just hope that this guard is gonna be like very confused about his surroundings for a while. Because international is in a kind of a bad position. Oh shit! Forces. Ugh. Alright, let's move you here. And if the guy decides to come over there, we'll do a melee reaction. Now you. Get over there. Keep the prisoner safe. Somewhat. Peek through the door. There's no one there. Yeah, we have the cameras. That was a foolish move. The guards are somewhere over there, I think. There's a door there. We can safely get international into this room. Okay, there's the enforcer. This get in the area. And there's another guard. Okay, so this is an interesting point for you, eh? You find this interesting? Open the door. Then we sneak behind this guard. No, actually, we sneak behind the okay, international. Can you reach any guard at all? Prisoner can only move this far. I sincerely hope that this is the point that this guy wants to check out. Actually, can we observe him? 
can tell. No, he's the one that moves over there. Let's preserve this guy. Status hunting. He moves forward. I think he wants to check out this. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna overdeck it. Oh god, please. Okay. Now we take him out. And, uh, hide behind his, this wall, like, no, hide behind the desk. Actually, we sit in the guard. We, can we drag the body a little bit? No. That's great. We hide behind the desk, then. I oh, should have sit, sat in the guard. Well, anyway. I'm panicking a little bit, as you might tell. Let's move this guy over there. That tile is noticed, are you kidding me? Okay, this guy's all, the, the scene is already merely overwatch, merely reaction, whatever that is called, mode. Actually, I think we just get over there and just aggressively discharge this guy. Okay, now we close the door, just in case, just in case, and we sit on the guard a little bit. A little, just a little bit. Now we're so darn close to the elevator. We just need to get out of there. Can the prisoner actually sit in the guard? That could be really useful. Alright, Deckard. He probably go and... Oh, he can't KO! Shit, I forgot. He cannot KO. Okay. Now... Things could just get a lot more interesting, eh? Should have been sneaking a lot more than that. International cannot disable the guard. Do we just keep all of our agents together? Alright, so the enforcer's somewhere over there. He's doing he's being stupid. We hide international behind a door like this. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. Deckard. Pray to all heavens that this guy does not turn around. Actually, we can... Okay, he, he does turn around. He goes over through there. He's obviously going to see this sleeping guy. He actually delayed his wake up... Wake up uh, Wakey wakey status. Alright. Observe the guard. Where is he gonna go? Where are you gonna go where are you gonna go, buddy? Where are you gonna go? Well we obviously need to hide. You know what? Let's all hide in this room for now. At least we got all of our guys together now, do we? Okay. Enter. Nobody wants to check out the cells. Another two enforcers, but we're about to get out of this mission, so... That is A-OK -okay by me. Somebody finally wants to... find out what's going on in the cells. You could hide behind this under the cameras. You could uh, observe this unit. Uh, I think he's just going to be stationary for a while. Oh god, zoom in. Alright, Miles Wheel works pretty... Miles Wheel is freaking out, is what I'm trying to say. Alright, we're just trying to get out of here. At this point. Enter. What happens, happens. Alrighty then. Okay. Shit. Shit. Wow. Like, everybody got into this room at the same time. Really? Okay, international. Oh, shit. 
Run, girl! Run! No, we gotta get shot. And the prisoner got spotted as well. <sighs> one turn, one turn, it does it all. And you're gonna get shot. Where did this guy even come from? just all die here. <laughs> wow. What a freaking turn. What a freaking turn. Damn. That was rubbish. Anyway, well, I think that's gonna do it. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and possibly subscribe to my channel for things like this. I'll see you next time. As, uh, as always, have a good day. That was Invisible Ink. That's a very rough and unforgiving game. I like it so far. Anyway, see you soon.